Hello everybody, it's Nathan with the Unapologetic Hunter. Today I'm going to <clears throat> talk about uh, this Ruger single six pistol. I've done a review on it a little while back, part of my weapons of choice video uh, series. Today we're going to be actually shooting it. It's a pretty old Ruger single six. I've had it for a very, very long time. What I hunt mainly with it is uh, believe it or not, frogs. Here in the state of Kentucky, you can you can either jig frogs or, or uh, shoot them. Most people take a 22 rifle and uh, what people down here in, in this part of Kentucky uh, uh, calls a wheat light. Uh, back in the part of Kentucky I grew up in, everybody called it a mining light. They'll, they'll take a 22 rifle and a mining light and hold the mining light up beside the rifle where they, and it'll help them see the sights and, and shine the frog and uh, they'll shoot it with a rifle. If, if you do this method, you gotta be very, very accurate because if you if you don't shoot the frog right, just right, it'll, it'll kick out in the water and you won't get it. So you pretty much have to shoot right in between both eyes. It'll, uh, the frog won't kick out. With a pistol, what we do is we sneak up really, really close, keep the light in the frog's eyes and shoot it with a pistol. So, uh, Today I'm going to do a accuracy test on this. Uh, in my opinion, if if I shoot off or whatever, it's probably going to be my fault, not the guns. Another thing I'm going to cover in this video is uh, how you don't have to break bank on targets just to go out and plink with your your guns. So I'm going to <clears throat> we'll walk up here to the makeshift target I got here. I'm going to shoot this gun 12 times. So I've uh, took a silver Sharpie and a cardboard Amazon box, and I have drawn 12 different circles and kind of squiggly them in there. So uh, I'm going to attempt uh, to set back there, and, and what I've got is 21 feet, just like a, the distance if, if you're, you take your concealed weapons you know, I figured that'd be a good distance to, to do this test. You're you're never gonna be shooting that far at a, at a frog with a 22. I mean, we get right up on them and shoot them, but uh, I'm just gonna shoot this gun six times where it's a revolver. Of course, un unload it, reload it, and then uh, shoot it six more times, see how it goes. Well, uh, I guess the next thing you're gonna see is bullets either hitting or missing uh, 12 terribly drawn targets. Okay, so, uh, well, <clears throat> not not too awful terrible for an old man that can't shoot anymore, but uh, 21 feet's pretty pretty decent, you know, shot for a, a 22 pistol. So let's see what I've done here. Okay, so I I got in the in the bullseye on one two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of them. Uh, got real close on two of them and just absolutely all out missed one of them for some reason. Guess I bobbled a little bit or whatever. But uh, not not too bad for a little 22 pistol at 21 steps. Um, 
you know, you, you go take your concealed weapons permit and you got to put them all in a big old silhouette target or whatever. Uh, we're shooting a little, little dots here. Not my best shooting by far, but uh, still not too awful bad. I mean, you, you can tell that uh, the, the little, little pistol is really accurate. Um, the, uh, the, the person that wouldn't wait, I know what I've done here. I've shot at this one target twice. There's, if you look real close, I cut my bullet hole out. So I must have shot, come down here and shot, and then shot again, and then, then rode on. So uh, that's just be, me being goofy. So really, I, I guess I, I got 10 out of 12 of them and uh got pretty close with with two of them so uh that that ain't that makes me feel better but uh guys i'm telling you these uh these little ruger single sixers are are pretty awesome they also make a ruger wrangler um they're they're uh they're cheaper they they kind of compete with the the heritage about in the same same price range um really really good uh little pistols too um i guess the the single six is pretty expensive these days uh back when i bought that one it, they wouldn't all that much but uh the ruger wrangler you know if you want to buy a pretty good pretty good little 22 revolver single action without breaking bank that's a that's a pretty good option to go to well hope y'all enjoyed the the shooting or their lack of shooting Really appreciate it if you'd subscribe, like the channel, and uh, you know, throw some comments out there about what you think and uh, about how you like the the single six, or you know, if there's a a single six uh, or a single action twenty two out there that that you prefer, we'd like to hear about that too, or or some comments about uh, frog hunting with a with the twenty two pistol. Uh, but uh, everybody appreciate it. Uh, Thanks for thanks for watching and uh, God bless you and uh, just just keep on uh, not apologizing for your God-given rights to to hunt and defend yourself. Thank you.